Hello everyone, I'm Teacher Newton and this is the Melhores Seu Inglês Podcast, o seu podcast de dicas de inglês. Hello everyone, in this week's episode we are going to learn how to use see somebody do and see somebody doing. So, first, let's study this example situation. Tom got into his car and drove away. Imagine that you saw this, so you can say, I saw Tom get into his car and drive away. In this structure, we use get, drive, do, etc. But we don't use to get, to drive or to do. Somebody did something and I saw this, so I saw somebody do something no infinitive here. But after a passive, he was seen, etc., we use to. For example, he was seen to get in the car. Study this example situation. Yesterday you saw Kate. She was waiting for a bus. You can say, I saw Kate waiting for a bus. In this structure, we use ing, for example, waiting, doing, etc. Somebody was doing something and I saw this, so I saw somebody doing something. Study the difference in meaning between the two structures. For example, I saw him do something is the same as he did something as simple and I saw this. I saw the complete action from the beginning to end. So let's see some examples. He fell off the wall. I saw this. Therefore, I saw him fall off the wall. The accident happened. Did you see it? Did you see the accident happen? I saw him doing something is the same as he was doing something past continuous and I saw this. I saw him when he was in the middle of doing it. This does not mean that I saw the complete action. For example, he was walking along the street. I saw this when I drove past in my car. So, in a sentence, it, it would be I saw him walking along the street. Sometimes the difference is not important and you can use either form. I've never seen her dance or I've never seen her dancing. And we use these structures with see and hear and a number of other verbs. I didn't hear you come in. You came in? I didn't hear this. Liz suddenly felt somebody touch her on the shoulder. Did you notice anyone go out? I could hear it raining. It was raining. I could hear it. The missing children were last seen playing near the river. Listen to the birds singing. Can you smell something burning? I found Sue in my room reading my letters. And this was the Melhores Seu Inglês of this week! E se você quiser falar inglês em tempo recorde, entre em contato com a gente! Aulas individuais e personalizadas no Skype ou WhatsApp. Mande uma mensagem para Erika de Padua, Erika com K, arroba gmail.com ou no WhatsApp 31 99223 31 992235540 e faça uma aula experimental gratuita para dicas de inglês, exercícios e muita coisa legal para você aprender inglês sozinho. Procure por Melhore Seu Inglês no Instagram, Facebook e YouTube e visite o nosso site melhoreseuinglês.wordpress.com. Keep improving your English and see you on the next episode of Melhores Seu Inglês!